Yo guys, welcome to my Uber Lab Loots video for Saturday, January the 29th. In this video, I'm going to be running Uber Lab, getting as many efficient keys as I can. I'm going to be enchanting a bunch of different helmet base types. This will also be my final video of the week since the new league is going to be dropping on Friday. Stay tuned to see what awesome loot that I got. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. We got three keys. See what we get. Beautiful. Alright, helm enchant time. Here we go. Uh, Divine Ire, 15% increased beam width. Uh, lightning trap element effect. Uh, rune blast teleports you to detonated rune. I have no idea what rune blast... Well, I know what rune blast is, but I don't know how it works. Uh, these ones seem pretty bad, but I'll take a quick gander. So all of these enchants are crap. So we'll just do this, get that out of there. There we go. And then for loots, we didn't make anything. I got this item earlier, but it's not worth anything. All right, next lab, next lab. Here we go. Three keys. Oh, we got some currency this time at least. Not good, but got some. All right, let's see if we can actually get a good enchant. Forbidden right fires an additional projectile. I have a feeling that's going to be good. Uh, mana bound damage, chain hook. And uh, avoid being stunned if you've killed recently. I have a feeling that Forbidden Right. No, it's Forbidden Right. I'm thinking of uh, the minion one. Never mind. We'll see. Absolution, I think, is what I was thinking of. All right, I am going to put Forbidden Right on this helmet for 6.9 exalts. So here we go. Uh, Kerpow. Additional projectile, so apparently that's uh, six exalts or six point nine. Uh, get your mind out of the gutters. <laughs> so six point nine exalts, and then a bunch of uh, uh, currency that's not really worth anything. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. Three keys. Damn, five keys. What's with all this loot? This is lab, not I don't know blight. A couple C there. All right, enchant time. Uh, Cold Snap AOE, War Chief, uh, increased melee damage while active, and Ice Spear travels reduced distance. That one seems like it might be okay. I gotta check these out real quick. Alrighty, I'll put this thing on a Veridi's Veil. Uh, Ice Spear one goes for an Exalt. All right, there we go. And then for our loot, I had a lab that my video corrupted before, so this is kind of like loot from two labs. Uh, so we got 2C, uh, 2C, 3C, uh, 4 with the fragments, uh, 5, 6, 7C, I would say, out of that, out of two labs. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go, two keys. Must have forgotten to kill Argus. Oh, well. Got these two. Oh, three chisels. Oh, got some fragments. Let's see worth. All right, enchant time. Here we go. Uh, ball lightning area of effect. Explosive arrow has increased duration and cold snap damage. So uh, explosive arrow one might go, but I don't know what it will go on. Let me see. Alrighty, we're gonna go ball lightning area of effect on count of the inward eye it goes for an exalt. And then for loot, made 1C and probably 2C, I'll say out of that. 2C. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. We have uh, three keys. Oh, well, we got a bobble. An axiom. Alright, that was pretty awesome. Alright, for enchants, an earthquake area of effect. Zealotry has reduced mana reserve. And a mirror arrow. So probably the zealotry one that's going to sell on this one. Let me check it out. Alrighty, this enchant sells on an Alpha's Howl for an exult. So uh, there we go. Kerpow. And then for loot, we made a bobble. Big money on that one. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. Three keys. Five keys. Now get me one good chest. Alright, offering and some fragments. Okay, we got a chaos. Yay. 
All right, enchant time. Here we go. Uh, lightning arrow, area of effect. Uh, forbidden right, an additional projectile. I'm pretty sure that's really good. And conductivity curse effect and the life regen. So we got at least the life regen, but I'm pretty sure the forbidden right one is like seven or eight exalts. All right, we're going to do forbidden right for uh, 6.9 exalts. And there we go. And then for our loot, we got one C, a bobble was from last lab, and then uh, some jeweler's orbs. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. Three keys. Six link. All right, we got. Uh, I think there are thirteen C for a divine orb. All right, and here we go. Uh, puncture duration, infernal cry, increased global cooldown recovery rate, elemental hit damage. I don't think these are going to be worth anything. Uh, I'll take a quick gander. Alrighty, I'm gonna try Infernal Cry cooldown recovery rate for 2x on a Royal Burn Burgonet or whatever they're called. So that and then uh, 1C with the fragments that, and then the Divine Orb. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. We have two keys. Ooh, gems. Those must be big ones, 18 percenters. I don't think these really go anymore just because of the um, uh, heist gems. But we'll use them for some GCPs. And for loot, uh, Glacial Hammer has chance to freeze, uh, explosive concoction area of effect, and righteous fire increased spell damage. That'll probably sell right there, the RF one. Well, I don't know if it'll sell. It's pretty late in the league, but it'll be worth the most. Alrighty, I'm going to put this thing on a hubris circuit. I forgot to grab one before I unpaused. Do I have any, uh, there we go. Oops, that goes for four exalts. Or uh, I think it's up for five. Yeah, so I'll go 4.9. So righteous fire, bam, 4.9 exalts. And then we made a chaos infusings and uh, yeah, I'll say chaos with these two as well. So 2C. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. Two keys. I cannot do this yet. GCP. One, so it's two C and loot there. I think. Alright, uh glacial damage as extra cold that usually uh sells okay on an abyssus. Lancing steel, nope, and nope. And I forgot to buy boots again. Probably get some uh tomorrow when I finish up recording so let's see what the uh, one enchant's worth alrighty we're gonna do glacial hammer on abyssus for 1.9 exalts so there we go and then for loot's got one C on the way here two with the uh, fragments and then three with the GCP alrighty next lab next lab here we go we have uh, three keys let's see what we get I got some gems. There we go. And then for enchants, we have frost bomb. A lightning golem deals increased damage. And wow, those are like the three worst enchants that you can think of. Those are terrible. All right. Uh, yeah. Actually, let me check that for uh, Ed Ziri's boots. All right, I am gonna try to put that enchant on that Ziri's step. Do this yet. I'm gonna try it for like half an exalt. Uh, let me grab my boots here and see if it goes. I don't know if it will or not, but there we go, Kerpow. So uh, in that lab, we made an orb of binding and friendship card. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go, three keys. Oh, nope. Uh, a couple fusings. All right, enchant time. Uh, soul ran hinders enemies. Uh, flesh offering duration and power siphon damage. Too bad that wasn't an extra projectile. Let's check out power siphon damage. All right, I'll try uh, power siphon damage on crown of eyes for 49C. You never know. It's not like they're that expensive anyway. 
49C. There we go. And then we made uh, probably about a chaos in, uh, in loot there. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. We have two keys. Let's do it. I've got a chaos. Some alchemies. All right, enchant time. Here we go. Uh, ice crash damage. Dominating blow can summon additional sentinel. Uh, extra copy of animate weapon. So let's uh, see what we got here. All right, I'm going to try to animate weapon uh, extra copy for one exalt. So there we go. And then for loot, I made uh, one C, uh, two with the Val and the uh, Chromies. I'll say probably that mess would be three C around there. Alrighty, next lab, next lab. Here we go. We have two keys. Okay, I was going to say, are we going to get anything there? Not even a chaos worth of fragments. Damn. Righteous fire spell damage. That'll sell for sure. Uh, sigil power and uh, infernal blow. There's a couple of good enchants. Infernal blow one usually sells pretty good on Abyssus. Uh, we'll do the righteous fire one, though, probably on a hubris. All right, we're going to go righteous fire on a circuit for 4.9 exalts. Kapow. Did I hit the right one? I did. So we probably made a chaos out of the uh, loot there. Alrighty, next slab, next slab. Here we go. Two keys. The lion, the inventor, the vulture, emperor's luck. Alright, enchant time. Uh, I don't know about the link skills, so I'm not even going to bother. Um, precision, increased mana reserve efficiency, and viper strike damage. So the precision one would probably be the best. Let me look at it. All right, we're going to do precision on Alpha's Howl. Uh, the cheapest one's up for five exalts. It seems a little pricey to me, but uh, yeah, let's do it. I'll put up for 4.9. And then for loot, we just made a bunch of cards. Nothing really that good. Alrighty, guys. Next slab, next slab. Here we go. Two keys. Got gems. Only four, though. Oh, there's a bunch here. There we go. And then for our uh, enchants, we got uh, Exerted by Ambush, 40 Decrypt Multi. Uh, effect of buffs gained by your Carrion Golems. And Stormbrand does increase damage. So I'm going to have to take a look at these puppies. Alrighty, I'm going to do a Stormbrand on a uh, Hubris Circulate for 2.9 exalts. Let me grab one real quick. Where is it? I cannot do this yet. Uh, Stormbrand, there we go. Kapow. And then for loot, we need a chisel. Good old chisel. Alrighty, so for this portion of the video, I'm just going to go over the loot that I had in my chest and uh, go over the helm enchants that I listed. So let's start with the uh, chest loot first. So for Chaos, we had four, so we made four Chaos. Uh, we got one C worth of uh, GCPs. For Fusings, we got two C worth. Uh, for uh, Jewelers Orbs, we got three C worth. Scours, we got one C worth. Alchemies, they're 10 to 1, so uh, I didn't really add this into my thing. Uh, Divine Orbs are 13 C, so 13 C there. Chromatic Orb, I had two C worth. Regrets, I had one. Alts, I had three. Uh, Val Orbs, I had one. Uh, Chance Orbs, I had two, but they're ten to one, but I figured if I'm removing the Alks, that would uh, boost that one up a little bit. Uh, Chisel, I had one C worth. And Fragments, I had six C worth. So in total for the uh, loot from the chest, I made 40 C. And then for the loot that I s I'm selling, it probably won't sell because the league's ending like in a week. As of recording this video, uh, I had uh, two Forbidden Right uh, Helm Enchants. Uh, I have them up for 6.9 exalts. Uh, Ice Spear on a Viridi's Veil, I have up for 0.9 exalts. 0.9 exalts for this one with Ball Lightning Area of Effect. Uh, Alpha's Howl, 0.9 exalts for Zealot Tree. Uh, Infernal Cry, cooldown recovery rate, two exalts on that. Uh, 4.9 exalts for Righteous Fire, I have two of these. 
uh, for an Abyssus, uh, Glacial Hammer is extra cold damage. I have up for 1.9 at Ziri Step 75C. Uh, Crown of Eyes with Power Siphon damage for 49C. Uh, Hubris Circuit uh, Animate Weapon Copy for 1 Exalts. Uh, Elphus Howl Precision 1 for 4.9 Exalts. I'm pretty sure that won't sell, even if it was like mid league. And then uh, Hubris Circuit with Stormbrand damage for 2.9 Exalts. So that's uh, my blah, 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 blah. my lab loot roundup, and this will be my final video for this league. Uh, next league, I will probably be like two weeks in before I get a lab video out because I want to get some currency to do uh, uh, bases as well as uniques, and bases are usually pretty expensive for item level 86. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys in 3.17.